A lunchtime run to Tony's Pizza here on Rutland Road in Brownsville turned violent after three men in their 30s were hit by bullets. Sources tell PIX11 News the gunman pulled up in a black SUV with two other men and opened fire. Bullets riddled the streets, an unsettling sight to people who live and work in the area, especially the timing of the shooting. I think that this shouldn't happen in broad daylight, plain and simple. And it does not matter what neighborhood or the time of day. Gun violence is happening around the city. From Brooklyn to Harlem, this surveillance video shows just how disturbing the violence is playing out on the streets. PIX11 News obtained this new surveillance video. It shows the last moments of 14-year-old Justin Streeter's life. Police say a gunman shot Streeter and another teen as they walked from a deli near East 128th Street. The other teen survived. It's nothing new here. You know what I mean? It's nothing new. Back in Brownsville, Victor Valentin works at the pizza shop where the shooting happened. Now he can't work. We usually close at 9, and now they got to go home now because nobody's allowed inside. But it's more than just losing a day's pay. It's another thing he has to worry about. I think about my family, especially my son. Overall, the NYPD says shootings in the city are down 9% year to date compared to the same time period last year. And the number of victims are slightly less as well. So far this year, there has been 903 victims. Last year, 974 victims. Still, the numbers are not changing their perception. Sources are telling us that as far as the shooting here in Brownsville that the victims are known to the suspects. So police believe this could be gang related or some type of retaliation. Still, if you have any information on any of the shootings we've been talking about, call Crime Stoppers. The number's right there. It's 800-577-TIPS. 